nation's unemployment rate is slowly improving, but certain occupations aren't coming back. We're going to run through 10 careers that are on the decline based on poor pay and projected job losses through 2020. Some fields are victims of technological advances, think robots and the internet, while others are being hurt by overseas outsourcing. To lessen the sting, we've also identified viable alternatives for each. Here we go. Despite boasting the highest pay of all the jobs on this list, post office clerks have the worst prospects. The U.S. Postal Service has been losing business steadily to other delivery options, including private delivery companies and the Internet. An alternate profession? How about shipping and receiving clerk for a government agency? Some of the duties are similar and the pay is decent. Automated answering technology is rapidly replacing humans and the trend shows no signs of flagging. Instead, get hired as a customer service rep. You can still assist people on the phone and you'll probably get paid a little better. Not all technology jobs are created equal, or secure for that matter. Semiconductor processors who oversee the production of microchips are being replaced by robots, which are better at working on increasingly smaller chips and maintaining a sterile work environment. Instead, consider becoming an electronic engineering technician. The position requires similar skills, but there's demand for it. Clothing, textile, and furniture production jobs are all under stress, with demand for worker services expected to drop by 9.6% by 2020. Sewing machine operators will be among those suffering the worst job losses. Many companies are trying to cut costs by sending these jobs overseas. What to do instead? Go custom. Tailors are projected to fare better, expecting a small but positive growth rate of 2%. As more readers reach for digital versions of books, newspapers, and magazines, the folks who actually print those things are losing jobs. Plus, the process of getting publications ready for the printing press is increasingly being automated or handled by office workers. So what instead? Plastics. Actually, metal too. Workers who operate machines that cut, shape, and form metal and plastic materials are looking toward a more prosperous future. Another casualty of the print industry's struggles, desktop publishers are quickly losing their seats. As the software to lay out the design of printed materials gets easier to use, companies are either outsourcing this job or assigning the tasks to other employees. A safer related job is graphic designer, though you'll generally need a BA to get hired. When businesses are able to contact millions of customers online, ringing doorbells has become enormously inefficient. Instead, why not employ your sales skills, maintain your independence, and still wander door to door as a real estate agent? Demand for agents and brokers is expected to increase by 11.3% and the pay is better. So go get your license. Budget conscious consumers are opting for fresh cut flowers from grocery stores instead of elaborate arrangements from florists. So if your heart is set on flowers, look for a position with a grocer instead of a flower shop. But if you're willing to shift your focus, become a merchandise displayer. You can apply your keen eye for design to displays inside shops, in store windows, and at trade shows. The shift toward the digital consumption of news continues to pressure newspapers, magazines, TV, and radio. And while it's true that more money is being earned online as a result, that's not enough to offset the lost revenue. The result? Smaller newsrooms. An alternate career? Well, get on the other end of the press release and pick up a gig in public relations. PR specialists are in much higher demand and earn more than reporters. Demand for jewelry workers who do everything from resized rings to polish precious stones will decline as low skill tasks are increasingly shipped overseas. But if bling is your thing, you'll have a better shot in the business if you've graduated from a jeweler training program. An alternate career for those with an eye for beauty? Interior designer. More education and possibly a license are needed, but the income potential is better.